Liberia, and we're coming to your life from the headquarters of the Jefferson Tamakoni, CDC Secretary General, and a new chairperson of the CDC, Emmanuel Momba Johnson. Abu Bakapa, of the Arab of the Arab so we also been told that uh, as part of this uh, press conference, uh, the president So you hear a noise in the background, folks. Wherever you are, share this live video as we bring you everything we have here. Under the Saturday tree, this is where the CDC usually converge. This is where they gather uh, whatever they want to have. A very large event gathering. Uh, they want to have something very serious. Uh, see here today, it's going to be a uh, very, uh, I don't know how to feel about it. CDC standard bearer Josh Malawi that we've been told that he will come here today. But this is just a preview. That's how we said coming to him. He live from the heaven. So these are all supporters of the CDC, members of the CDC, executive members of the CDC. 
So if you get it all loud and clear, please let us know. If you just get it, if you're problem, please let us know. Uh, what our sound uh, system is sound and clear, whatever you are, please let us know about our sound system, whether we live, whether it's clear, you can let us know. Uh, wherever you're from, this uh, afternoon coming to you from Pogba Town, yeah, the ground saw the whole of a democratic change. So tell us whether you can get all loud and clear, whatever you're following from, whatever you're watching from, tell us how well you get in our signal of this Thursday uh, afternoon from Pogba Town. So that's the mayor, the former mayor of the oh, it's a former mayor of the city of Monrovia, Jefferson Tamakoji, and you also see the same conversation. of the CDC, uh, George Manawia, Alasha Howard is also here, Alasha Howard uh, is here, uh, the assistant to the former Minister of Finance, Alasha Howard is here, uh, so we say folks, keep following wherever you are, I will tell you. The way you go, make us to go. Papa, we are, Papa, we are, Papa, we are, we may see ya, we may see ya, Papa, we are, we may see ya, we may see ya, we may see ya. The place you go, the place you go, we want you to come, the place you go, we want you to come, we our country, Papa, we are, Papa, we are, we may see ya, we may see ya, we may see ya. The place you go, make us to go. The way you teach, make us to learn. The things you do, make us to do. Yeah, tell me why you say. Tell me why you say. Tell me why you say. Masses party, masses party, masses party. The people's 
pâté, Cassi 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 pâté, Cassi
Harris Lele is a professional media colleague. This is what you see whenever you watch the CDC. This is exactly what you see them doing. They are good at for these things. So we are coming to you. Lara Putu, militants of the CDC, the young people, the exuberance are there. When you see these people dancing at this, I mean, it brings so much joy to them. They never get tired. The energy is built up. The energy is built up. The CDC, whoever, wherever you find it from, this is the CDC, wherever you watch it from. Yes, the CDC. So that's the noise in the background, folks. This is something called party loyalty. Party loyalty is being shown, is being exhibited. It's been seen here uh, from the CDC. Party loyalty is being seen here from the CDC. Shirley Whistler, Wesley, Shirley Wesley, Anthony Rogers, they are following the broadcast. Uh, this afternoon, Emmanuel Moba Johnson, and the youth chairperson of the uh, Revolutionary National Youth League, Jefferson Tamakoji. Jefferson Tamakoji, they are here this afternoon. Ayo, 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 ayo
When he bounced back 2029, that is a story to tell. That is not the public to tell. But we are here. And of course, 
Jefferson Tamakoji, former mayor of the city of Monrovia, arrives with delegates, and of course, we see Randa Dubai is also here, folks. We see the chairperson of the youth league, Emmanuel Mwaba Johnson, is catch on his dancing. I'm not to buy the sauce with the air folks. This is CDC. This is what you see. This is the insurance. Uh, wherever you are from, whenever you see this, it is CDC. This is what they know them for. This is what you see. The belief in doing this and never give up the struggle, even in opposition or in government. The CDC is always there. Young people is committed to this party. This is why we call CDC. This is the real CDC. Thank you, Salute. Welcome to Liberia, folks. We are today on the Sakamo tree. So I have the convention. The former chair president of the CDC, Noah Molo, resigned his post to step down as chairman of CDC. Uh, yeah, we have to see although who is the chair president. We have to know who will be the next uh, chairman of the CDC. Uh, Kola Yomo is also on this line. Liberian man is on this line. Morris Jones, folks, wherever you are, this is Channel Liberia. Liberia's only political online blog is here. Bring you live this gallery under the Sakamo tree of the CDC. Folks. Moses Scully, Honorable Bobby Benito, Benito, a strong supporter of the CDC, is here. Bobby Benito is the supporter of the CDC. is live following Shala Beria. Whether he's in the US, well, I'm sure Bobby is in the US. Bobby is here following this live. This Yes, this is CDC for life. This is a CDC. For what? That's the noise you hear in the background. CDC. For what? 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 Forward, forward, the peace and justice say forward. Follow the following. Down, 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 I think we shall take the podium. Make a way to the Salaman Tree Stadium. 
Allez, oui, c'est. Abbé Our program, our meeting is about the indemnable minor coalition for democratic change. So, the party, as a matter of fact, is the ruling party 2029. Oh. Yeah. And I saw is following from Dubai. The ruling party 2029, the indemnable minor coalition for democratic change. So, And so the father will speak to the broader masses of our people on critical national issues. That is the beauty of revolutionary movement. Now to Western Congress, we ask you to remain reticent and follow the actuality of the revolutionary itinerary. Amanda! Thank you. Move quickly to first item on our agenda. It has to do with opening prayers. I will quickly invite Mother Comfort Lord, who will consecrate the revolutionary joining of the indemnitable Mali coalition for democratic change. Oh. Move into about 2029. Put the hands together for her. Put the hands together for her. Do that, do that, don't worry. Amanda! Amen. In Jesus' name, Amen. in Jesus' mighty name, Amen. somebody shall me glory. No, he looked like the glory is shot, he paid for it. The last night he went to bed, he paid for it to wake up. Mm. Hallelujah. Amen. You have a few attach. You know, pay a dime. Hallelujah. Amen. Somebody shall me glory. Jesus mighty name, let us bow. And so, Father, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, we say thank you. Our Lord, our Creator, our Maker, we say thank you. Our life giver, we say thank you. Our battle for commander, we say thank you. That we say thank you because you are very great in battle. We said thank you all your way. Jehovah will never slept together, but he made out to meet together this hour. We worship you, bless you. We reference you, salute you. That you God will give you that adoration. That you will say, you have to do what you have done. It. We said thank you all your way. We said thank you because you have proven our enemies wrong. We said thank you because you have proven our enemies wrong. We said thank you because we are determined in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Our enemy are in Syria in the name of Jesus of Nazareth. We said thank you. We said thank you. We present the occasion it is. As we about to go through the occasion that we need your presence, we need your anointing, we need your law, we need your unity. Tell God to take control. May you speak before your children speak. That your name will be glorified in Jesus' name. Amen. Clap for the revolutionary mother, Amanda. The welcome remarks will be done by the Irudat Irudentes Vice the acting chair president of the Intermittent Commander Coalition for Democratic Change. Before he comes to Manda Rush, the Honorable Mama C. Kaba to introduce. The of our party. Thank you, Comrade Wilson. So, Mama In absentia, His Excellency Dr. Josh Manawia, political leader of the Mighty Coalition for Democratic Change, Honorable Jefferson Tamakoji, Secretary General of the Mighty CDC, Honorable Mwaba, 
Honorable Imana Moba Johnson, Chairman of the Revolutionary National Youth League of the Mighty CDC, Madam Fatou Soare, Chair Lady of the Women's League, Distinguished Partisans, Special Guests, Members of the Fourth Estate, Distinguished Ladies and Gentlemen, and our Muslim brothers and sisters, I bring you Islamic greetings by saying Assalamu Alaikum wa rahmatullahi ta'ala wa barakatuh. I am deeply honored to be given this opportunity to introduce and to invite to the Rosium a very strong and ideologue and an intellectual in person of Honorable Gapla Vincent William, we have some Tennessee. Oh. Well, I the microphone can spread the message, just so we can send that message out there. I have the privilege now to call to this podium our acting chairman, in person of Honorable Gapla Vincent Williams. Division of our country, we are present to our regional national youth league, our women league, to our zonal head that are considered our first soldiers, to all of our palaces across the length and breadth of our country, we salute you. Today marks a very important transition in the history of our party. As we would like to firstly thank the executive committee and a very special thank you to the standard bearer and political leader of our party, former President George Manewea, who has for the past three weeks extensively taking his time to sit with a cross session of our party where we had a wild consultative meeting. We used what we refer to as the bottom to top approach. And all of our partisans that had the opportunity in their respective capacity from their positions within the institution they had the time to engage the political leader. We sat there sometime up to 1 a.m., 2 a.m. in the morning, and we had the opportunity to cross through the 2023 election. Though other way file will be announced to you, but we just want to applaud our standard bearer and political leader for that time and the rest of the executive committee member of our party and to you our zona head our county leadership our main structure all of our party across the country we say thank you for your time thank you for your listening here yeah, thank you for the engagement it means a lot to us the success of the mighty coalition for democratic change rests upon you your dedication and your commitment to forge ahead. For us, this is all we have. And that's why our stream comes from you every time. Today's event, as we welcome you 
to the headquarters of the mighty coalition for democratic change. So, so. We want to say to you, there will be a series of layouts we will provide you. And don't forget, this party, we are going through a transition process where we have seen successive exits of chair pressing. And we have had the opportunity to do that transition. And for the purpose of our parties, we always like to remain steadfast. We always like to remain steadfast and perform our duty for the stability of our party. This case will be absolutely no different from what we have always done. But what is important for us is your collective effort for us to force ahead. And today we announce to you a series of different events. And that also to include for you the acting chairperson of our mighty coalition for democratic change. So, so again, let me say welcome to each one of you for coming. Let me say welcome again, each and every one of you for coming. Thank you very much. The voice of the acting chairman of the CDC. Put the hands together, put the hands together. For veteran, sedition, President Gabba Willem, the vice chair for um, of our party. Amanda, quickly move to overview of the location that will be done by Comrade DSG Random Master Stroke with the Passport Dubai. Put the hands together for him. So Rando Dubai will do Amanda 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 Where are we? Member of the now constituent political party of the ever putting mighty coalition for democratic change. Today we are glad to be here and to give an overview of our program. You know, after a consequential election, consequential because we are all witnesses to the current bad governance, we're all witnesses. The fact that Labra has been denigrated, Labra has been dragging the dungeon of absolute destitution in less than 100 days. And so, consequential because today in our country, if you are not from Lofa, you can't get a job. So it was consequential. Was consequential. It was consequential because even the blind man at this moment is seeing that Boga is not is not capable of leading Liberia. If he were capable, then they would not march at NASCO with uh, there's a corrupt pastor called Pastor Luther Tape. There's a guy called Pastor Luther Tapere. Right? Yes. A pastor and you go to forcefully take over. We say consequential because even on election day, instead of rejoicing, we're fainting. So we say consequential. It is consequential because today we see at LPRC, saying the Prince Moi wife is there. Not just that. We see the son of Vice President Jeremiah Boyokun. He is at LPRC. We say consequential because even though there is a hair at Maritime, but the, the, Mr. Joy has found the disaster what happened at NASCO. We say consequential because people are dying in multitudinal proportion. We say consequential because fire is everywhere in this country. We say consequential because the country is burning. And so, we was the presidential election? And of course, our president, our leader, His Excellency Dr. Dr. George Manese Posi for a clown. We are understanding the foundation of peace and tranquility, except a result in a number margin or a model margin, as you may say. 
Imagine, it's very tiny, like the eye of a, of a needle. He decided to go to Europe for vacation. And there were noise all around the corridor. He came back into the country. And upon coming back into the country, there were serious activities, engagement of partisan. So now we'll give you the overview of the meeting. But you know, when our standard bro was coming back into the country, something funny happened. Something very, very funny happened. You know, Labrador is the only country in the world where an unscrupulous, unpatriotic, and a standard bro of tribalism in Joe, the sleep hoop of Waka. We prevent, we prevent the vision barrier of an infrastructure from using it when after two days you will allow a musician called Fatou Gavlo to use the same entry. But when is that happening? It can only happen in Labro when it came in that same time period. Fortunately and unfortunately, there was a resignation of our party chairman. And so the standard bearer being a man of his people, understanding the credenta and the maradenta of politics in our country, decided to engage cross section of partisans to the four cardinal points of this country. Whether at the zonal level, whether at the level of the county, whether at the district level, at the religious level, the youth league, the women league, in every session of our party, he engaged everyone. Because he's quite aware that during these elections, the United Party, they were wholly desperate. Their desperation was like a disease from bread that has no cure. They were desperate, indicatively, or in capital letter written five times with seven exclamation marks printed in red. They were desperate. They were so desperate to the extent that Buaka admitted that he was willing to die in one with the devil. No wonder why the devil is killing people and horses are burning today. And so there has been meeting. And so today, the essence of today's meeting, you know, I'm not a guest speaker here today. I'm just a Johnny Baptist. I'm in my little Jujutsu. And we are flowing. And so, today's meeting, today's gathering, is to unclose or, or I may say, disclose to the partisan of this great party some of the preliminary outcomes of those engagements we're listening to. Yet we say, citizen not talking. We are the creator of talks. I hear citizen not making moves. Yeah, we are the makers of moves. We understand the people's issue. But we've been having consultation. Our political leader been engaging. Our political leader been listening. He will act based on what the people say. He doesn't act on his own. And so in today's meeting, you listen to our Daname Vice Chair for Administration, who is also the acting chairman of our party. The party never run out of men. Men are always here. You listen to him, he gave me a very splendid welcome remark. And so in today's program, we listen to uh, speeches and statements from those cross sessions of people that the standard bearer have met. What were the outcome? What is their impression? And what is the dynamics for a way forward? <laughs> That is the essence of this program. So, comrades, friends, dear partisan of ever put the matter correlation with democratic change, oh. it is my pleasing honor to now reduce my heart and go sit down. Thank you very much. Voice of Randa Dubai, speaking former deputy director. Imagine the mental organizing having a consultation for the main cause. <laughs> they not be easy. <laughs> Amanda! This part of the year! 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 It's not going anywhere! It's not going anywhere! It's not going anywhere! Thank you! Thank you! At this time, we move quicker now. You listen to. 
the overview, listen to the at the chairman. So people who participated participated key actors and stakeholders from that meeting will be called, will be brought here and will give you a few statements and will make some remarks. So those who participated that they already catalog the cross section of our partisans, cross section of our organic structures in the party, met with the standard bearer and the governing council of our party, and a serious manner con consultation. And that consultation is why we are here to tell about the outcome. So we start with the first question on our list. Put hands together as we invite to this motion the coordinator chairperson of the National Coordinator Council, Comrade Myers Bitye, who gave us in three minutes. So before, quickly, Sarah, before we go to Comrade Bitye, why is not away? It is important that we do not escape tradition, and that tradition is meant to be obeyed. Tradition is meant to be obeyed and not to be understood. So quickly, we we'll let them know the kind of caliber people here in this program that has to do with recognition of our guests and strategic party officials. But because of time, we ask that the the comrade Adolo Abu Bagaba will do for all the in, the recognition of guests. But it will be in brief that the tenure of Moses Zebla will be very dwarf. I know that intellectually he cannot, he cannot, <laughs> he cannot wait to fire. But boy, you have our honor. Thank you ever so much. Amanda. Amanda. Thank you very much, Comrade Melitan Adiolo, Avin Fidel Castro Wissel. I've been given a very Herculean task to take on at this moment, but again, it is a territory that we have received tremendous training from, and within through the tutorship of uh, the only Julius Malima of Labera, Jefferson Tamakoji. <laughs> So do we, we have the tenacity, the fortitude, and the intellectual calorie to take on this task. Having said that, um, this country has made a mistake. That mistake, we are paying for it, even though we never signed up for it, most of us, or all of us here, as we believe. We now have our closest neighbor to be mosquito and heat and poverty on an alarming level. How be it? We cannot forget about the coalition. In so doing, we like to recognize men who were on the right side of history in 2023 and who are those team members. So we'd like to recognize in a special way the movement for economic empowerment of MOVE. If I score the name, please clap for them. The Union of Liberian Democrats, the People's Liberation Party, the United People's Party, the CDA, the RDC. The Liberal People Democratic Party, the National Patriotic Party, and the Congress for Democratic Change. <laughs> Having said that, we would like to give a special recognition to those who never go to bed without thinking about CDC, and they do not wake up without thinking about CDC. The Zuno Council. Coordinators, the chairpersons of the various counties, our 
energetic and beautiful members of the Women's League. To compendomize and having we say what we say. To compendomize. To harmonize. To clamize. To eschatomize. To eschatomize. We'd like to give a special recognition again to Madam Fatou Soare, the chairperson of the Women's League and the entire executive committee of the Women's League. The honorable comrade, compatriot Emmanuel Molba Johnson, Elias Neto, who is the indefatigable chairman of the Revolutionary National Youth League, of the Coalition for Democratic Change, a man who continues to tread the path of teaching on a daily basis. In fact, yesterday at 4 a.m., I said, Chairman, are you not going home? He said, I'm not going home. Once there is one citizen here, I will not go home. Thank you, Chairman Mito. We'd like to recognize the Honorable. The only scientists, may I say, in this gallery, though there are many scientists in the CDC, the man who left the stage before I came, Randolph Master Stroke Dovayu. And also, we'd like to recognize Comrade Fearless Fighter. A person who lived in the slum of the community before becoming minister, and she saw onto her life, she said, I cannot live from here. Once there is poverty here, we will change this place. Clap for Mama C. F. Kaba. <laughs> and in the conclusion, to conclude, I would like to recognize the entirety of all of you here, members of the media, before festing, our partisans. The acting chairman, the acting chairman, the acting chairman. This is Vladimir Putin. When you know Vladimir Putin, today Russia is going to election. He is going for a system to take him to 30 years at the helm of authority in Russia. No matter why in Liberia, he is one of the strongest political allies of the CDC. This is a man who has no, no other political party. And this is why we just call him Vladimir Putin. And so, Vladimir Putin, that nickname, Honorable Gabla Vincent Willem, please clap for him as I take the exit. Thank you very much. Thank you all so much. And no, come back. He told me, say, Bo, don't call me over fasting. As a board of the party mended. Imagine the men fasting in fire burning day. Only both finish fasting in powder. <laughs> that trouble. <laughs> the fire republic will be on fire. <laughs> Amanda! You're burning places like what you can't have for. You can't be burning all places. You know? Don't go around my terrain. Oh, yeah, are you fire you're doing? Don't go around my terrain. Oh, yeah, Amanda, you fire me, I will fire you. You fire me, I will fire you. Thank you. So, Comrade Colonel, in my beauty, the chair president of the Colonel Council, you have my revolutionary honor. Thank you, Mr. Acting Chairman and members of the executive committee of our party, Madam Chair and members of the executive committee of the Women League. Mr. Emmanuel Momba Johnson, <laughs> Chairman and members of the executive committee of the National Youth League of our party, the doing and members of the Coordinator Council, fellow partisan, members of the four estate, distinguished ladies and gentlemen, I have the single honor as the chairman of the Coordinator Council of the Mighty Coalition for Democratic Change, 
to extend my thanks and appreciation to the members of our Zelle Committee and the standard bearer of our party for a job well done. We won the elections in 2023 with the Warrior Council being the pillar of our elections. It is we that control the electrics and have power over the very constituency for our party. We did everything him on the possible on our control in making sure that the CDC received the needed victory. I want to say to you in a clear term that the CDC did well. We performed well, but we did not know how it happened. Let me be clear. I want to say to you in a clear term that the CDC performed well, we did well, but I can't tell you how it happened. But I want to appreciate our standard barrel. After the elections, there were a lot of horror battles around. But being a leader, a fight started, decided to speak to his people. And I can tell you for sure, we enjoyed the consultation. And I think today we are assembled here to commence the consultation that was conducted by our standard bearer with partisans of our party. I therefore want to say to you partisans, all is not lost. It is very essential for the regroup, put ourselves together, prepare for the next battle ahead. There is no time for blaming each and another. We all did well. We cannot blame ourselves. It is time now that we come together and build our party for the full march of our party so that the next elections we can do more than well. Mr. Acting Chairman, I want to say to you in this public manner, the executive committee of our party need to be very efficient and strong. Because we are at a crossroad. When you see in our country a party that was brought to the leadership of our party of our country, they are going offhand. And it is our responsibility to make sure that we prepare and make sure to govern our effort in order for our people to be united so that we can go for the next battle. Thank you, may God bless you. Thank you, thank you. There was so much. At this time, we call, we call on the women's lead child president, the Kadra Revolutionary Fatu Swari. Amanda! Amanda! In three minutes. Committee, the National Youth League, the National Women's League, our coordinators, I want to say thank you to every one of you. We all did well during those elections. We are here today to say thank you to our powerful Secretary General, first of all. Thank you for staying by us. Thank you for being here in the dying hours. Thank you for being the last man to leave the party headquarters. Yes. Thank you for being the only person that we could run to in time of emergency during those elections. Yes. Thank you, SG. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you. And I want to say thank you to our standard bearer. We all did our part and I will continue to say we never lost those elections. But based on the peaceful nature of our father, our political leader. He accepted result because of you and myself. He accepted the result because of our livelihood, because of our life. We want to say thank you to him. You know, when the election result was accepted by our political leader, some of us cried. 
But we went into our secret room, we realized that he did the right thing, and we'll continue to appreciate him for that. And I want to say thank you to the stand up bearer also for giving us his ears. He stayed at the party headquarters two to three in the morning just listening to complaints that came to him. And I can say to the National Executive Committee, the National Women's League, we are ready to work more than ever before. We are reunited, we are bringing the peace press. And Masarado, next time, what happened in Masarado will not be repeated. And for the rest of the contest, the women are ready to work and we'll put our boots on like our brothers in the National Youth League. And the women League will be more powerful more than ever before. Thank you. Amanda, what is a girl for the Women's League chairperson? Thank you for a very powerful, I can see from the eyes of faith that you're about to roll your sleep. The potency for your vote, the veracity. I can assure Baka that when the party allows you to go out, your being out will be cataclysmic. I saw comments, partisans. At this time, quickly go to the next person in line and that person will represent Mount Sorrell County as a matter of fact he is a freedom fighter and an admiral put the hands together for Cardinal Revolutionary James Fogba Amanda Amanda Amanda! In three minutes because of time, James Fogba, you have my revolutionary on on Kaju. Amanda! 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 Our standard bearer, the impression of George Manuia, members of our executive committee here present, our dynamic uh, secretary general, Jefferson Tamakochi, and also members of our Zaire community here present, distinguished partisan, cross section of press. We have come today to say to you, our partisan and public, that we should remain persevering. Because this party is what we have. This is our life. When I came to this party, I was in my twenties. Used to be on the fence. But the love of the party was inside within me. When Jeff came to this party, he said, my man. There's no more you, there's no more your offense again. You'll be a full flesh member of the CEC. So that's how I became the vice chair for administration in most of our country. So our county members, our uh, district leadership, we say thank you for all the time you spent here during the weeks. Our president going through some consultation of why we lost this election. But I say to you, come one May, President Joseph Walker, be warned.
We are coming for you 2029. Thank you. Thank you. So, put us again for the coming. Quickly, at this time, because of time, comrades, we ask you to be very brief and very succinct because of time. Amanda! So, at this time, we call on the former Secretary General of the Revolutionary National Youth League of the Indemnity Coalition for Democratic Change.